Our top story this morning, naval vessels from the two Koreas traded artillery fire on Thursday after the North fired shells near a South Korean warship on patrol in the heavily guarded West Sea. This the latest provocation against the South following weeks of military threats. South Korea's Joint Chiefs of Staff said the patrol boat was situated 14 kilometers from Yonpyeongdo Island below the northern limit line, the de facto maritime border between the two Koreas. The enemy's artillery shells fell near our patrol ship, and the Navy immediately fired back towards their vessel in retaliation. The shells landed about 200 meters away from the patrol ship, and there were fortunately no casualties. Ten shells were fired by the north, and five shots were fired back in retaliation, but only two of the South Korean shells crossed the northern limit line. An official from the Joint Chiefs of Staff confirmed the patrol boat was on the South Korean side of the NNL at the time of the attack. As a precaution, on Thursday, nearly 800 residents of Yonpyeongdo Island were evacuated to a nearby shelter. This attack came one day after the North Korean army threatened to attack South Korean naval vessels in that area.